Oh, man. Okay, in, in here there is nothing new. Okay, that's cool. Um, yeah. Those boxes contain nothing since we already claimed them and then they somehow reappeared. Whatever, dude. I'm not... This Zelda logic, whatever. I don't even know anymore. Yay! Okay. Um, looks like there's some sculptulas here. Well, there's sculptulas, just not gold sculptulas. Um, oh, there's a gold sculptula. Speak of the devil. Uh-oh. I'm gonna wait till I get up... Oh, well, I just got some bullets, because... I'm gonna say wait, I'll wait till I get up there to shoot it, because I only have two bullets left. Two bullets! Bullets! Bullets, sir. Bullets are bullets are prize. And there we go. And that is our, I believe, 92nd gold sculpture. Can you believe that? Seriously. Okay, oh, here is one of the points. If you remember way back in the desert when I was failing. Well, that wasn't way back. That was like last episode, dude. Oh my god, it's a bitch. It's a bitch fish. Die. Okay, I've handled you before. Don't stop being an idiot and just do it. There we go. Oh no. Oh, I don't have a shield. What am I doing? Just equip it any goddamn shield. There we go. Turtle Link, go! Pwn them! Pwn them, even though they're kind of turtles just like you. So this kind of feels traitorous. But not really, because they're monsters. Alright, anyone else want to piece me? Oh, I guess you do. Okay. Let's just pwn you like your brothers before you. Dodongo's Cavern and that one guy that just now, you know him. Well, that was easy. You didn't even put up a fight, man. And then you fell through the freaking wall. What's up with you? Anyone else want a piece of me? Anyone? What was the point of those two guys? Were they just to distract me? I guess so. Uh, is there a switch up there? Yes, there is. Let's hit it. Cool. Oh my god. What was that? Where was that? That was this. Okay. What will it be? Oh my god. It's, it's, it's a Deku Shield. Yay. I have a feeling that would have been five rupees. Oh well. Alright, so now in this room, there's nothing but a locked door. Some random freaking sun in the floor. It's really ugly sun too. And that. So, um, by the looks of it, we're going to have to blow that up. How do we blow that up? We are going to need something that you are never, never required to get in the game. So how would you do this? Would you have to go back and get these? Whatever. Bomb shoe. Go. I missed, but I was L-targeting it. Okay, let's try that. And yes! Awesome sauce. And the sun gets so happy. Lights up. And yeah. Um, I remember there being a third guy in here or something. Like, Oh wait, what's this? Didn't notice that. It is bomb chew, yay! So I guess that's how you're supposed to be able to do that. You don't have to leave the freaking temple, because that would just be even even there not that mean, I guess. Um, let's push you off the edge. I feel like killing some noobs right now. Oh look at that. I pressed a button. And I glitched out the wall kind of over there. Um, this is a room. You might want to take note of this room. We're gonna be seeing it a little bit later. But for now, um, that's pretty much all we can do here, just with that switch down there. You can you can go down there and do stuff. Well, actually, actually, yeah, let's go down there. I've never been down here before as a like a kid. Uh, that's a bit of a spoiler, but whatever. Uh, you probably knew we were gonna be coming here as an adult, anyways. Oh, uh, so can I do this? I can like use a Din's fire here. It looks like, but what what is it, what will this do? I'm not sure. Let's see. And boom! And ooh! Chest. Awesomeness. What will this chest contain? Let's find out. Yay! What will it be? I'm so excited. Could it be the dungeon item? Will it be the silver gauntlet? I don't know. That'll be awesome, but it's the map. Cool. And I don't think we'll be able to get the compass as a kid, though. So that's kind of uncool. It's uncouth. Actually, no, it's not uncouth. It's un it's just uncool. Because uncouth means something else entirely. Right, so the door that we unlocked, it was up here, in case you didn't notice. 
in case you didn't know. Na, 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 na. Oh man, I feel like I need something. Oh my god, what the? No, I didn't. I didn't want to use Din's fire. What the freak? Link, you're retarded. Face palm. Face palm. Face palm. Face palm. If only I could just lift your hand and put it at your face, Link. That would make me so so happy right now. Um. Oh, this room. This room is lovely. Um, we're gonna get our bombs, because we're gonna need them. And we're gonna watch a lot of stuff go boom in this room. Just like that guy. We watched him go boom. We're gonna watch this guy go boom. Yay. We're gonna watch... Oh wait, there's bombs over here to make more stuff go boom. We're gonna watch this guy go boom. Ow. Not before he hits us with this freaking laser. Is there anyone else we're gonna watch go boom? Doesn't look like it. But, as you can see, there are many, many silver rupees. There's a lot to do in this room, I'm not kidding. There's like a bunch of different puzzles. I think there's like three in all. So while I'm doing this, collecting these silver rupees, I probably need something to talk about. Since we've done this enough, you should know how to do this by now. Collect five, and something happens. Um, oh, I know what I can talk about today. Like, right before this recording session, I went to take my dog for a walk. And something about today, when I was outside, like, I don't know, something just seems weird about today. I don't know why, I can't climb that wall, I'm stupid. But like, I went outside, it's like a yellow tint outside, there's a big grey cloud in the sky, and behind that grey cloud is a grey sky. Um, that lit, the f that lit the fire over there. Which we'll have to use to light every other torch in this place. So that's what that's for, um, the acoustics, awesome. But yeah, so like, it's all yellow outside. There's nothing moving outside. There's no people out there when I went out. There's no cars moving at all. There is seriously nothing out there. And my dog, he wanted to go home earlier than he normally did. I don't know why. Like, I don't know what's up with today. It's just a weird day. And there's like nothing happening online even today. Like, ser I don't know what's going on. This place. Fuck you. Alright, we're just gonna relight all these, I guess. But yeah, like, I don't know what's going on today. It seems like the earth is kind of frozen, except for me. I don't know. Like, even my family, they've all gone to work. Which is why I'm happy I don't have a job. I don't have to work. This is my job, I guess. Alright, let's roll, see if we can get there in time. There we go. And that causes a chest to open over there. Where? Over where? I don't know. Over here? Possibly. But yeah, so I don't know what's up with today. It's just feels so weird, like everything is stalled, except me. Like, I don't know, it's hard to explain. Small key, awesomeness. But there is still one final puzzle that we've just been passing over very often. Let's see, it is this. Um, well first I guess we're gonna have to move this block out of the way. Alright, and we'll pull this to the side I guess. That just makes sense, we're gonna make a little path for our friendly Mr. Sunshine over here. Super Mario Sunshine! Ah. That's an awesome game, by the way. So underrated. Yep. And, no, and, you, and it, even though it's underrated, there's so many LPs of it out on YouTube right now. Like, seriously. Like, I'm gonna be doing one someday. Like, I know that. But whatever. Let's light up our friendly Mr. Sun here. We gotta, sh we gotta shine sprite. Ow. And we get hurt for it. Okay, um, in here there is stuff. I, oh, I hear a sculpture. This is the one. This is the one that I always forget. Like, nine, all the other 99 sculptures. Dude, don't do that. All the other 99 sculptures. I, I remember their locations pretty much perfectly. Like, when I pass by it, I, I will know that there's one there pro for mo most part. This one, I always forget that it's there. But then, thankfully, it's in a place that you can easily hear it. So, that's good. So I don't forget it ever. Even though I forget it. If that makes sense. Okay, this room looks weird. It's all L-shaped. Um, hello. You look very metallic. Are you sleeping? Can I pass by you? Yes, Navi, I know this iron bar is in front of the freaking door. Um. Hello. Oh my god! I woke him up. 
He looks angry. What are you? Iron Knuckle, i.e. Dark Nut of this game. Watch out for its axe attack. It hurts a lot. Strike when it drops its guard. Alright, so here's my strategy for this that I developed even for the first time I played this game when I saw no one play it. Basically, wait for him to attack. Um, ow. Yeah, he, his attacks are a lot. I think they do like three damage, maybe two hearts each. I don't know. But when he when he, he attacks, wait for him to finish his attack, then like backflip. Or what? When he starts his attack, backflip, and then when he finishes it, then jump attack, and basically rinse and repeat, just like I'm doing right now. And eventually he'll just fall down. So this is basically the boss of this portion of the temple, I guess. The boss of the child section of the dungeon. Or temple. Yeah, so he has like those two attacks basically where he swings from side to side or he drops down. You can also guide him into those pillars just like that to make him drop heart. Or to make him get hearts for you, I guess. Alright, come on, dude. Can you just die, please? Please. There you go. Was that so hard to die? You know, some just can't wait to die. And hearts, and yep. We're gonna be seeing those guys later on. Spoilers. But that's not the last one of those you'll see. And oh, we're going outside. Awesome. <gasps> what the? No! I thought I ditched you way back when. What the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what's up, Argon? Surprised to see me? Hells yeah, but buddy, what? You what? Ah, a long time in this world is almost nothing to you, is it? How mysterious. Even I thought that the tales of a boy who could travel back and forth through time was merely a legend. Well, I'm living, breathing proof of that, but what, still, what are you doing here? Argon, you have fully matured as an adult, even though you're seven years from being an adult. From now on, the future of all the people in Hyrule is on your shoulders. No pressure. Maybe it's not my time anymore. Here's my last advice. Thank you! Two witches nap at this temple. In order to destroy them, turn their own magic power against them. Hoodoot. Okay, we haven't met any witches yet. Mm, this doesn't really make sense to us at all. Do you want to hear what I said again? Not even for old time's sake, buddy. I'll continue to watch you. Hoo 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 hoot. Cause I'm a stalker. I'm a creepy stalker owl, okay, poor gay boy. Oh my god. And yes, I guess that's kind of foreshadowing or after shadowing or whatever. As to when you see him watching you while you play the Requiem of Spirit with Sheik. Cause that's who that was, by the way, if I didn't make that clear. But anyways, what's this? Is it the compass? That'll be totally fail after like a reward for being the boss is a compass? No. It's the single iron I and mean, si it's not iron gauntlet, the single silver gauntlet. With like it doesn't even have fingers, look at that. What the fuck? Okay, you found the silver gauntlets. If you wore them, you would feel the power in your arms, the power to lift big things with A. But these gauntlets won't fit a kid. Plus you promised to give them to Naburu. You should keep your word. I know. Damn Oh st sandstorm. What the hell? <gasps> Shrieking? What's going on out here? Hey, where are you taking me? Get out of my face, you bitches. Full moon. Ooh. Yarg, let me go. Well, I guess every night's a full moon in this game. Yeah, just look around, Link. Look around. Uh, oh, what's that? Link, don't look past it, you retard. You, you fiends. Ganondorf's minions. What the f- what? Hargon, get out of here. Now. Oh my god. These witches, they're using black magic on me. Dude. Well, I guess those are the witches that K. Porgy Bor was just talking about, but what the hell? Why would you do that? That was mean. And Link's like, oh my god, what the hell? What did I just witness? That was pretty crazy, dude. Well, whatever, let's just hop down now. There's no point to staying up there. Uh, anyways, that's the end of the Spirit Temple as a kid for now. And it looks like we're just at 30 minutes, pretty much. 29 minutes, 30 seconds. Um, so, I'm going to end this off here. Uh, thank you everybody for watching. This is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.